China's announcement of the Baidi B type, nicknamed the White Emperor, marks a dramatic milestone in military aviation and space defense. This sixth generation fighter jet, unveiled at the 2024 Zhuhai Air Show, is unlike anything we've seen before. It is not just an advanced stealth aircraft, it is designed for space warfare, capable of hunting satellites and potentially dominating near Earth space. Developed under Project Nantian Men, the White Emperor reflects China's ambition to challenge global powers in the race for next-generation aerospace technologies. In this video, we'll explore what makes the White Emperor so extraordinary, the geopolitical ramifications of such advancements, and the technological challenges it faces. China's project Nantianmen aims to achieve what has long been considered the holy grail of military aviation, a sixth-generation fighter jet with the capability to operate in both Earth's atmosphere and near-space environments. At the center of this initiative is the Baidi B-Type, or the White Emperor which is being touted as an integrated space air fighter. Its ambitious design claims to bridge the gap between atmospheric dominance and space warfare, giving it the unprecedented ability to engage orbital assets such as satellites. The fighter's design is cutting edge, combining stealth, maneuverability, and AI-driven systems to set new benchmarks in military aviation. The White Emperor boasts advanced stealth technologies designed to reduce radar and infrared visibility, enabling it to operate undetected in high-risk combat zones. Its angular, futuristic design, highlighted during the airshow, suggests a heavy focus on minimizing reflective surfaces to evade radar detection. One of the most talked about features is its space-air integration. While traditional fighter jets are built for terrestrial combat, the White Emperor is intended to function in near-space environments, where it could disrupt satellites or neutralize orbital threats. Although this capability is still unproven, it signals a new era in defense systems where controlling space-based assets becomes as crucial as air superiority. Adding to its versatility, the aircraft integrates artificial intelligence AI and data fusion technologies, enabling it to process battlefield information in real time. These systems allow the jet to act as a networked combat node, coordinating with unmanned aerial vehicles UAVs and other assets to deliver precise, data-driven strikes. Its expanded internal weapon bays enable it to carry heavier and more diverse payloads without compromising stealth, making it a true multi-role platform. However, the White Emperor remains a conceptual prototype. The mock-up presented at the Zhuhai Airshow underscores its futuristic potential, but also highlights the significant technical hurdles that must be overcome before it can become operational. The unveiling while impressive, serves more as a declaration of intent than an indication of readiness. The White Emperor is not just a leap in technology, it is a strategic statement. By developing a fighter jet capable of space warfare, China has sent a clear signal to the world it intends to be a dominant player in both the skies and space. This move raises the stakes in the already intense military competition between China, the United States, and Europe. Globally, the Baidi B-type places China in direct competition with the U.S. Next Generation Air Dominance NGAD program and Europe's Future Combat Air System FCAS and Global Combat Air Program GCAP. While these programs aim to deploy sixth-generation fighters by the 2030s, China's unveiling of the White Emperor suggests it is determined to narrow the gap sooner than expected. This development could accelerate the timeline for similar projects worldwide, creating a new arms race in next-generation aviation. In the Indo-Pacific region, the White Emperor's potential deployment could dramatically shift the balance of power. For instance, its ability to target satellites or GPS systems could disrupt critical communication and navigation networks, undermining the capabilities of adversaries in regions like Taiwan or the South China Sea. Such capabilities could force neighboring countries, particularly India, to rethink their defense strategies. India's indigenous advanced medium combat aircraft AMCA program may need to fast track its development to counter this new threat. The concept of a space-air integration fighter aligns with broader concerns about the militarization of space. Satellites are crucial for modern warfare, enabling communication, surveillance, and precision targeting. 
The White Emperor's ability to potentially disable or destroy these assets represents a paradigm shift in military strategy, where controlling space becomes as important as dominating the air. China's unveiling of the White Emperor also sends a geopolitical message. It demonstrates the nation's growing self-reliance in developing cutting-edge military technologies, reducing its dependence on foreign suppliers. The timing of the announcement, coinciding with the 75th anniversary of the People's Liberation Army Air Force PLAF, underscores its importance as a symbol of national pride and military modernization. As revolutionary as the White Emperor sounds, its development comes with significant technological and engineering challenges. Building a fighter jet capable of operating in both atmospheric and near-space environments requires breakthroughs in propulsion systems, AI and materials science areas that even the most advanced militaries have yet to perfect. The most immediate hurdle lies in propulsion. The White Emperor would need engines capable of transitioning seamlessly between the dense atmosphere of Earth and the vacuum of space. Such propulsion systems must operate efficiently in drastically different conditions, including temperature extremes and varying air pressure. While China has made strides in engine development, as seen in the J-20 stealth fighter, it has also faced setbacks, particularly with achieving reliable performance in advanced jet engines. Another challenge is the integration of AI and data fusion technologies. While these systems promise to revolutionize air combat, their complexity introduces vulnerabilities. A developing AI that can autonomously process data, make decisions, and coordinate with other assets requires advanced algorithms and robust cybersecurity measures. Any system flaws could leave the aircraft exposed to hacking or operational errors, undermining its effectiveness in high-stakes scenarios. The space operational capability of the White Emperor adds an additional layer of complexity. Operating in near-space environments requires innovations in structural materials to withstand extreme conditions. Furthermore, the inclusion of life support systems capable of sustaining pilots at high altitudes or in space presence yet another technical hurdle. These challenges, combined with the logistical difficulties of producing and deploying such advanced systems, suggest that the White Emperor is still years away from practical use. China's past struggles with advanced jet development also cast doubt on the feasibility of achieving the White Emperor's ambitious goals within a short time frame. The delays and technical issues faced during the development of the Chengdu J-20 stealth fighter highlight the immense challenges of producing next-generation aircraft. Despite these obstacles, the White Emperor remains a bold statement of China's technological ambition. Its unveiling serves as a reminder that the militarization of space is no longer a distant concept, it is a reality that global powers must address. Whether or not the White Emperor achieves its full potential, it has already reshaped discussions about the future of aerospace and military strategy. The White Emperor is more than a fighter jet. It is a symbol of the future of warfare, where the boundaries between air and space are blurred. As part of Project Nantianmen, it embodies China's vision of technological dominance and its readiness to challenge global powers. While still in its conceptual phase, the White Emperor has sparked critical discussions about the implications of space warfare and the militarization of near-Earth space. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on space exploration and scientific discoveries. See you next time.